with over 7 million views. She's an undisputed top cat. We travel to Australia to meet Didja and her human, Robert, to find out why she took up skateboarding. I didn't really choose the skateboarding. She chose the skateboarding. Some guy just rode up on the skateboard and she wasn't afraid of the skateboard. And when he stepped off of it, she stepped on the skateboard. So everything is done very patiently. And it took, you know, over a year and a half for the one video to be not only the tricks to be trained, but then to film. I'm a dog trainer without a dog. Cats are so much more rewarding and challenging. I just thought, because dogs are relatively easy to teach, if I could train a cat, well, then I can probably train any dog. Robert is clearly a cat whisperer. So how does he teach Digi to do tricks? We tend not to think of cats as being as trainable as dogs, and they're not. But you can train some cats if you put enough work in. That's exactly what Robert has done. He's trained Digit to sit on the skateboard. He's gotten Digit to associate a certain behavior with the food reward and the sound of a clicker. This is called positive reinforcement. All right, the first time I'm probably going to put her over. In order to train a cat or any animal to do a very complicated move, you've got to be able to do it in steps to break it down. And this is a process called chaining. Ready? Yay, very good, and we'll click. For each trick, Robert adds layers of command, eventually including a verbal instruction and a hand gesture. If Didja does the trick correctly, then she'll receive a food reward. Eventually, she'll associate the verbal command and the behavior with food. And the personality of the cat is important too. Cats tend to be a lot more timid, whereas dogs tend to be more outgoing. So you have to find a cat that's willing to be trained. Oh, jump. That's good, girl. Digi can do over 50 tricks. Sit, stay, shake, high five. Digi, jump. It takes a lot of hard work and patience, but we can see that it is possible to train your cat. You're limited by your cat's scaredy cat factor, so focus on a cat's strength. They may not be able to ride a skateboard like Digi, but maybe they can do other things that are spectacular. 